Corona Viride. It's a family of it's family of coronaviruses. Mm. Even though we do get the coronavirus quite a lot yeah. in everyday life, because there's a um, coronavirus called coronavirus um, 229E. That is the common cold. You know what I mean? So yeah, technically, yeah. we get that stuff all the time. It's just it's yeah. not not a great strain, and it can't do nothing to us really. You know what I mean? But yeah, so there's a there's a family of them. You've got SARS, which happened in China 2002. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like took out quite a lot of China. Then you've got MERS. You know what I mean? And that happened in the Middle East and that. That's why when everyone's saying, oh, it can't really like do something in hot weathers and that. Well, MERS was in the Middle East, mate. Like it was hot over there. So for example, say if I got it, can my dog or cat get it? No, because viruses, yeah, there's viruses that dogs and animals and cats that can catch. There's viruses that humans can catch. And very, very small times can a virus live in both a human and an animal. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And the ones that can, so obviously that can transfer from an animal, that's what they call zoonotic. Yeah, yeah. Bob, you got, you're sick, bro. I saw that the other day, yeah. I thought, I'll never remember that word. Yeah, that, it's, a yeah. Zo it's zoonotic. It means you can try, it can travel, it can pass from animal to, to like a mosquito. Yeah. Yeah. If a, if you, a mosquito is infected and then well, it, 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 it bites you, you can be infected by well, that mosquito. Like, that's why they're saying with this coronavirus, they're trying to say it's either a snake, a bat, or I found out a pangolin. That's what it is. Pangolin. Like, a pangolin. A pangolin. Never it's heard like of it. If an armadillo and um, an anteater had a love child, that's what it looked like. <laughs> oh, like a tiger lion, a liger. Sort of thing, yeah. Oh, okay. But it's not like that's yeah. a, there's actual species of animal called a pangolin. Oh, I don't know if that's the, they're the two. That Damn. Would be mainly, but I'm just saying, to me, that's what it looks like. It's like a love child of them two things. What's a quick question? I got to ask you, look back. Hear this, though. Did you know this fact? That. Corona has more than one strain. Yes, there is a family called Corona v Corona Vide, I think it's called. And there's you, MERS, SARS, and and you do know that this strain of the Corona is like the nineteenth strain. Mm -hmm. And you know that this has happened before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, we get coronavirus so, all the time. You know that, right? So obviously, that means it can definitely happen again. So this is like Sky, but Sky Plus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> more like, yeah, more like, yeah, 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 yeah. It's okay. just there's no rewind. Nah. Like there's no rewind, so, it? it's live. But he said the next one, so the next one will be like HD. Next one could no, be... No, no, that's 4K. 4K. Next one's 4K, oh, okay. bro. Okay. 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 Immersive. Yeah, yeah. Immersive, yeah. bro. Like, I truly believe that if the next pandemic that comes mm. could be the one that wipes us out if we're not ready. I believe that if it is Mother Nature, Mother Nature has rolled a dice. She's been playing numbers, isn't it? You know you've got a lot of people that like to play numbers with people live than that, with viruses and all sorts. But the thing about it is they can't play numbers as many times as nature can. Nature does it trillions of times a day. Yeah. Luckily, yeah. she's fucking rolled a one, bro, to this time. She's rolled a one. If she rolls up if she rolls two sixes, we're done, bro. Done. That's nature. Imagine imagine a, imagine an even worse strain of bird flu. Because that's what could happen. Remember, the, the bird flu is, is still here. There could be a, it could be a worse strain than that. Yep. Remember, the next strain that comes along is going to be worse than what we're seeing now. Of course. Strains only adapt to mutate to be better in the environment. And to defend against things that are trying to stop, stop them it. from being around. Yeah. Because this corona strain is a mixed strain with Mars. Yes, Mars from the Middle East. Yeah. Oh, okay, I thought you said the chocolate. <laughs> Yo, no, I mean, it's slow. I mean, it's slow. You have to break it down a little bit for me, isn't it? Yeah, but so, carry. Mars, basically. Well, not, it's actually not called Mars. It's called MERS. Right, sorry, sorry, I said it wrong. Yeah, it's MERS. Oh, okay. Yeah. Give me yeah, some right. So, Corona Viride. It's a family of, it's family of coronaviruses. Mm. Even though we do get the coronavirus quite a lot yeah. in everyday life. Because there's a um, coronavirus called Coronavirus um, 229. E, that is the common cold. You know what I mean? So yeah, technically, yeah. we get that stuff all the time. It's just it's yeah. not, not a great strain and it can't do nothing to us, really. You know what I mean? But yeah, so there's a there's a family of them. You've got SARS, which happened in China 2002. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, took out quite a lot of China. Then you've got MERS, you know what I mean? And that happened in the Middle East and that. That's why when everyone's saying, oh, it can't really, like, do something in hot weathers and that. Well, MERS was in the Middle East, mate. Like, it was hot over there. Like, <laughs> yeah, so it was again, that, that thing there, yeah, um, 
MERS and Corona, obviously they're mixed. Now Corona is affected by heat. Yeah. A MERS, bit, well, yeah. MERS, yeah. I am not too sure about having researched that. No, nah, MERS is not is not actually as affected as much by heat because it's it was basically done. It it became zoonotic zoonotic in the heat. So basically in that this one quick statement before I go into what I was gonna say was um we're talking about we've been told that certain things live in certain heats in it yeah and then we get confused why in certain countries mm -hmm. it still survives yeah but when they're talking about certain heats they're not talking about the external heat they're talking about the internal heat of the body human body yes if the yeah. human body reaches a level of zero in freezing then no virus can live in that body no if a body reaches a certain temperature of a hundred mm -hmm. Then that virus would then be killed off in that body too. Yeah. Hence why but we have a fever. Has to. Hence why yeah. we have a fever because a to fever is a natural. Out. Yeah. It's yeah, a natural, natural reaction, reaction to burn out a virus. So if you get your body temperature up, then more than likely or low, then you're going to be less, I suppose, uh, prone to the thing. You know. Mm. But um, going going on to the next point was about um, so it's mixed is a mix of MERS and Corona. Mm. So what this. Um, Scientists basically were saying was that what it is it affects the respiratory system, yeah, and yeah. It creates the mucus that we got inside of us, mm. yeah, it crystallizes it, so it makes it hard, and then we can't breathe because it's crystallized. Mm. So that's the real issue in it. So he obviously then said there's certain things that you can have in your life, eat in your life, there's normal foods in that, mm. which obviously are very alkaline and which break up. That mucus. That mucus. But things like ginger. Yep. Lime. Yeah. All the stuff that you talked was, you talked yeah. about before, man. Big up yourselves, everyone. Yo. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel all day, Make every sure. day. Don't forget to subscribe to my guy's channel. The link is right here. Drunk days. days. My guy Tyrone B dot. Don't know. Here. His link is right there now. There Big red button. Press there. <laughs> now hook up. Jeez. Jeez.